Millions of bees are either dead or dispersed after a crash yesterday morning. The insects were set loose when a truck carrying hundreds of hives overturned. Our Garrett Berger talked with the president of the local beekeepers association about what the loss of these insects means. And bees like to stick everything together. Cracking open a beehive can be a prosperous endeavor. With rewards like wax and honey. As the Alamo Area Beekeepers Association president, Rick Fink, showed us firsthand, it's not an easy or risk-free task. They're really not terribly happy right now, so I think maybe we should put it back together now. You can see the effect of opening just one hive just a little while ago. So imagine hundreds overturned on the highway. With 400 or so hives involved in Sunday morning's crash, the fire department said they couldn't get to the driver because of swarms of bees, so they used foam on them. Fink wasn't at the scene, but he doesn't blame the fire department, noting it was an emergency. It saddens me definitely from the standpoint of the loss of bees. Uh, you know, I'm glad no people were hurt. It definitely saddens me from that standpoint. Bees play an important role in the food chain as pollinators for numerous plants we eat. Particularly a lot of your uh, melons and fruits, uh, berries, you know, apples, that kind of stuff. And Fink expects that these bees were likely headed for Californian almond orchards when their ride crashed. This time of year is when they start transporting bees because the almond pollination is approximately from the 1st of February to mid-March. So at the very least, the loss of these bees is going to be felt by their owner and whoever was relying on them at the end of this trip. Garrett Berger, KSAT 12 News.